So I was making a video of um, a few bikes I collected on Monday from Huggy Speed Shop. Um, this is the first one. It's, it's uh, XT500. Um, first year model, low cylinder exhaust. Uh, manufactured December 75. Um, it's got the wrong indicators on it, but it has got the brackets there, which are quite hard to get hold of. Real, rear um, light bracket. Um, Tank's been sprayed, rims look all right. Plastic shot, been in the sun. Um, the, these indicators, obviously, these these are Honda, and I think the headlamp's Honda. But I have I've got a an XT one. Um, I say fairly low mileage, six thousand miles on it. It's supposed to be a runner. Um, so that one, I've already ordered the plastics for that one. But I think that one should be fairly easy to. Uh, you know, fairly easy to get going and tidy up. So that's the first one to, uh, first one of the projects. Walking into the shop, we've got a 76 TT. Um, modified a little bit. Um, super trap on it, works shocks. YZ rim, it's got an XT front wheel in it. Um, with big McCuny carb on it with an air filter underneath it. Uh, which I think is K&N Seats all fairly decent apart from the cover. It's got DC plastics on it um, It's got nearly a full tank of petrol, but all the petrol stale nice big bars So uh, yeah, that one should be an easy one to get going also um, Next one I bought was a 77 TT Got quite a few um, aftermarket bits on it. I've been told that swing arm's a, a cross up swing arm, a bit like the Thor one. Nice big bore exhaust on it. Big air filter. Great big Dell Auto carburetor on it. On this one, the rims are good. Um, can't see much of it because I'm a bit, a bit full in here. Obviously the plastic shot has been in the sun. Um but yeah quite looking forward to working on that one. This one has had a bit of abuse. Um I think it's been used for hill climbing. Nice tall bars on it. Um big bore exhaust again nice big carburetor um, which I think is a McCuny. I'm not had a, a good look at it. K&N filter, both rims are buckled on this one, um, and the rear loop's been buckled in, so somebody's gone over the back of it at some point or other. I think it's been used for hill climbing, but uh, it's had some abuse. And then the last one is a, another XT500, low slung exhaust, this one's got a super trap on it. Which will take off because I've, I've I have got a, a rear silencer for it. Got a DT backlight on it, which will do for the time being. It's supposed to be low on compression, which I have had a look at. Seventeen thousand miles, so it could be just a stuck open valve or a well worn barrel and piston rings. But uh, it's got its airbox. Um, rims look fairly tidy. Um, I think it'll tie, that one will tidy up also. So there's five bikes here. Um, I'm gonna be doing a bit of work on them, and what I'll do when we do it, I'll uh, post stuff on um, on YouTube, you know, for everybody to see and uh, you know comment on. So see you so long.